I am Anabel Garcia. I came to the Women's Hospital at Renaissance on January 3rd, 2012 because I had a subchorionic bleed. So I uh, came in and my water ruptured 30 minutes later that I came into the hospital. It was very, very difficult, but um, our nurses were wonderful. I could just name a few, which I can't name all of them for the same reason, but they were wonderful with us even emotionally. I would come crying and they would do their best to keep me calm at all times. He's just a true blessing. The nurses know how hard it was for me. I'm a hands-on mom. I had to pump every two hours. I had to be there with my son. I had my other two children and he's my miracle. My sister Olivia Flores lived here in McAllen for many years and she was very independent all her life. She became paralyzed. She had a atrial fibrillation and an embolism as well. I've never seen such a loving, tender care towards any patient, and it makes me very happy that she's here in this hospital. And let me tell you, I've been in many hospitals, Chicago Cook County, the Cleveland Clinic, MD Anderson in Houston, St. Luke's in Houston. I've never seen the whole group being so in touch with a patient. I want to tell everybody, especially those in charge, appreciate your staff. Give them thanks because I've seen how wonderful and what a pleasant way to treat the patients. They show the loving care that a patient needs because when you are sick or in the hospital, you need pampering. I wish I could name everybody, but rest assured that you will be recognized one way or another, or at least from a thank you note that I intend to send you from Arizona where I live. Thank you very much. I am William Restrepo, a physician here in the area. I am a cyclist, very active physically. I was surprised when I discovered that I have a coronary artery disease and re require open heart surgery. I have a wonderful experience in intensive care. The nurse, I don't have words how to describe how appreciative I am from the nurses, so kind to me. I am convinced and I will do not hesitate to recommend to the Dr. Hospital Intensive Care for any intervention. They will be treated care with care, they will treat it with love, and they will treat it on a daily basis with tender care. Seeing and being part of the nursing team is such a privilege, and I want to thank all our DHR nurses for all the hard work that they do, whether they're, it's hands-on, or it's behind the scenes looking at our EMR. Um, everybody, everybody puts their own stamp uh, on patient care and we wouldn't be where we're at without their help and assistance. So thank you very, very much. When I think of a DHR nurse, many words come to mind. Kind, caring, compassionate, thoughtful, all of our nurses have had challenges and work better than any other facility. We provide the best quality care and I'm proud to say I've had the honor to work with all of our nurses. When I think of a DHR nurse, I think of extraordinary. Okay, let's start with loving, caring, devoted, brilliant, beautiful, heartfelt, professional, simply the best. I want to wish all the nurses in this very special week the very, very best and give them my heartfelt thanks and gratitude for the work they do for our patients, for our community, and for the hospital as a whole. And uh, the best uh, bookmark that we have is when people come back to the office and I always ask them, uh, how was the hospital? What was your experience at the hospital? And I would say that 999 times out of 1,000, they're extremely pleased. They're going to be recurrent clients, people that will be coming back for more services. And women being the gatekeeper of uh, our health for the whole family will always keep coming back for everything at Renaissance. And that's the message that I want to say, to thank you all and keep up the good work. When I think of nurses at DHR, three words come to mind. 
phenomenal, beautiful, and brilliant. DHR would not be the hospital it is today without each and every one of you delivering care. Thank you for all that you do. You're amazing. As everyone knows, the nursing staff is the lifeblood of any hospital. I've never encountered a group of nurses in any hospital where I've worked that are more dedicated and hardworking than our great nurses at DHR. Thank you for all you do. Mwah! From the entire Longoria family, especially from Camilla, we want to thank all the nurses and all the staff for making our time here so very special. Bueno, mi nombre es Luisa, Luisa Escamilla y este, tengo tres hijos. La, la más chiquita, Ana Luisa, uh, ella tenía 29 años. Desgraciadamente, cuando cumplió dos añitos, que fue en el 84, me la diagnosticaron con cáncer. Sus 27 años fueron de, de doctores de hospitales. Fueron 10 años de entrar y salir del hospital. En su momento que Ana llegaba, siempre me la atendían. A urgencias fuimos muchas veces. Las personas de ICU, para mí, son unas personas, unos ángeles, porque me, me la atendieron siempre muy bien. En los pisos, casi recorrimos todos los pisos, el segundo piso, el primer piso, el tercer piso y el cuarto piso. Quisiera mencionar a todas las enfermeras, darles mi agradecimiento, porque este, yo me sentía como en casa. ¿Cómo estás? ¿Cómo supieron que estaba aquí? you guys for all your help, your concern, your support. Thank you very much. From my daughter Ana Luisa Infante and my name Luisa, we thank you very much. And God bless you. Your compassion, your skill, your knowledge, your caring makes a difference in their lives and their families' lives. You are what makes Doctors Hospital at Renaissance special. We have entrusted you as a hospital, our patients' health, their very lives, and you make the difference. Thank you and happy Nurses Day. The nurse is the one that represents the hospital more than any other person in the institution. So they are a critical component that uh, cannot be replaced by a machine or a computer. They, they really are probably the single most important uh, and valuable employee within the hospital. My thank you to the nurses comes directly from the heart. So thank you very much for what you do for us and for your patients. If I could describe them, I would you know, describe them as being very dedicated, being very professional, and in a lot of ways being uh, angelic. Many of our nurses um, have been angels to many of our patients and their families. What's certain is that when you come here, the nursing staff is gonna take uh, the ultimate care of you as a patient or your family member. Uh, they're gonna treat you as if you were their family and therefore will provide a, an excellent experience. So those things um, you know, are what make our nurses fantastic. So from the bottom of my heart, I'd like to say thank you very much. It's been a pleasure to work with you guys so far. Uh, we will continue to work together, and uh, please uh, don't lose that spirit. Um, it is why patients come back, and it's why physicians continue to come here and enjoy treating patients with you. All I can say is that you all are the ones that make everything happen in our hospital. We didn't get to be top 100 U.S. News and World Report hospital because uh, we're just DHR. We're there because of our nursing staff. If it wasn't for our nursing staff, 
nothing would happen. We would grind to a halt. It's a partnership between physicians and nurses that make it possible to do things the DHR way. You guys are an integral part of our team. You are very appreciated. Um, I thank you from the bottom of my heart for making it possible to care for our patients together. And I thank you for helping us to keep and create the culture that lets nurses be nurses and doctors be doctors. Thank you so much for everything you do.